Hey there! Welcome back to this channel, NAW32. In this video, we're going to show you how to do a BIOS flashback on the ASUS motherboard. This is a really useful feature that allows you to update your motherboard's firmware even if your system won't boot up. BIOS flashback is a feature found on some motherboards that allows users to update the BIOS firmware without having a CPU or memory installed. It is especially useful when a new CPU is not supported by the current BIOS version, or when the existing BIOS becomes corrupted and the system fails to boot. To use BIOS flashback, the user must first download the latest BIOS firmware from the manufacturer's website and save it to a USB flash drive. Then, the user must plug the USB flash drive into the motherboard's BIOS flashback port and press the BIOS flashback button. This initiates a process where the motherboard's firmware reads the new BIOS file from the USB flash drive and overwrites the existing BIOS firmware. It is important to note that not all motherboards support BIOS flashback, and the exact procedure for using this feature may vary depending on the motherboard manufacturer and model. Additionally, improper use of BIOS flashback, such as interrupting the update process or using an incompatible BIOS file, can cause permanent damage to the motherboard. Therefore, it is recommended to carefully read the motherboard's manual and follow the manufacturer's instructions when using this feature. In this tutorial, I will use ASUS TUF Gaming B550M plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard for example. As you can see before the updates, this motherboard use outdated BIOS firmware version 0304. We will update this motherboard to the latest BIOS firmware version. Let's get started. First, before started, let's locate the BIOS flashback button on the motherboard. On the ASUS TUF Gaming B550M Plus Wi-Fi 2, the button is located next to the USB flashback ports on the rear I.O. panel and is labeled as BIOS FLBK. Okay, next, you'll need a USB flash drive that is formatted in FAT32. Make sure that the flash drive doesn't contain any other files, as this can cause issues during the BIOS update process. To format a flash drive for BIOS flashback, you can follow these steps. Connect the flash drive to your computer's USB port. Open the File Explorer or Windows Explorer program on your computer. Locate and right-click on the flash drive icon in the This PC or Devices and Drives section. Click on Format in the context menu that appears. In the Format window, choose FAT32 as the file system. Make sure the Quick Format option is selected. Click on the Start button to start the formatting process. Note. Formatting will erase all data on the flash drive, so make sure to back up any important files before proceeding. Wait for the formatting process to complete, which may take several minutes depending on the size of the flash drive. Once the formatting is complete, the flash drive is now ready to be used for BIOS flashback. Once you have your USB flash drive ready, plug it into your computer and download the latest BIOS firmware. To download the latest BIOS firmware for your ASUS motherboard, follow these steps. Visit the ASUS website at www.asus.com. Click on Motherboards, Components at the top of the page. Select by brand, series from the drop-down menu. Because my motherboard is Tough Series and use AMD platform, so I select Tough Gaming Series with AMD socket and chipset. Select the series and model of your ASUS motherboard. In my case, I select ASUS Tough Gaming B550M plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard. Click Learn More. In this page, click the support at the top of the page. Click the driver and utility on support page. Select the BIOS and firmware category. Select the latest BIOS version from the list of available options. Click the download button to start the download. After BIOS firmware downloaded, open the zip file and extract the files to USB flash drive the zip file contains two files, one BIOS firmware with CAP file extension, and the other one is BIOS renamer file with X extension. After all files fully extracted, Click and run BIOS renamer file to rename BIOS firmware's name to default name so motherboard can read the file. Press any keys to proceed. 
Okay, now your USB flash drive is ready for BIOS flashback, turn off your computer. Before BIOS firmware flashback, make sure you connect the ATX power connectors to motherboard. Then, power on the power supply. For BIOS flashback process, you don't need to turn on your computer. Now, let's move on to the BIOS flashback process. Insert the USB flash drive into the designated USB BIOS flashback port on the motherboard. Then, press and hold the BIOS flashback button for about 3 to 5 seconds. The light near the button should start blinking, indicating that the motherboard is now in BIOS flashback mode. This process is complete when the light stops flashing. Usually can take up to 10 minutes, so please be patient. Wait for the light to stop blinking. This means that the BIOS flashback process is complete. Once this is done, you can remove the USB flash drive and turn on your computer. After your computer boots up, go into the BIOS setup by pressing F1, Dell or F2 keys and check that the firmware version has been updated to the latest version. As you can see, now my BIOS firmware is updated to the latest version, 3001. And that's it. We've successfully performed a BIOS flashback on ASUS Tough Gaming B550M plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard. Press F10 to save and exit BIOS setting. Thanks for watching this tutorial on how to do a BIOS flashback on the ASUS motherboard. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech tutorials like this.